When Joel's parents were out of the house he called the sex worker, he has not understood anything because of this. He had also called all his friends at home, he converts it into a business, the movie starts and we see our main character, Joel he was hanging out with his friend he was telling about the strange dreams he gets, he jokingly says that I was with my neighbor's babysitter last night, no one believes him he has a friend named Miles, he tells Miles that I was very scared because of this I could not do anything. Miles gave him advice and said that sometimes in life you have to be carefree, we have to speak about some things, what will happen will be seen. Joel's parents were about to go out of town so Miles said don't let this opportunity go. Joel's parents are very strict and tell him that when we come back we should meet the house as it is, don't touch anything. Father had a music system he doesn't like Joel teasing it when his parents are gone. Joel enjoys playing music very loudly alone in the house. In the next scene when he is with his friends he learns that one of his friends has got admission in Harvard, he and his friend named Barry discuss it that they should also do business, this will improve their grades a lot. They were going to sell from one device and they started working on it, only then a friend of his comes to his house, Joel's parents were not at home so he had brought his girlfriend along, they both went upstairs and started getting intimate, their voice disturbs both of them a lot so they go out of the house. Joel's father forbade him but still Joel takes out his postcard and goes for a drive, trying to make an impression in front of the girls, there was a car at the signal they also raced with them, had a lot of fun tonight, next day his friend Miles comes to meet Joel and says that now your house is empty and you cannot let this opportunity go, he was looking for service providing girls in the newspaper, Joel doesn't show any interest in this, he was scared so Miles called directly to the house at 8 in the night. Joel gets very angry on this, Joel again called that number but only message was going he did message, now at exactly 8 o'clock in the night there was a knock on his door when he opened it, there were a gay service provider, Joel angrily calls his friend and asks for help but his friend was not going to come, this man told Joel that I have come so far, you have to provide me for service whatever money Joel's parents had given him, he has to pay it all. While leaving the man gave him a number and said you need it, at night, Joel feels need of a girlfriend and calls the number he had received, other main character whose name is Lana, came to him to provide that service, he got intimate with her in the night when he asked charges in the morning, Lana said that $300 but Joel did not have that much money, he says I have to go to the bank if he breaks bond, he can get money from it, Lana says that I do not like to wait more, by the time Joel comes back, Lana has left but she takes an antique piece of Joel's mother with her, Joel gets into trouble, he needed money to get this piece back again then Joel told the whole problem to his friend, they had come to a hotel looking for Lana where he notices that she came out of the hotel and says take me from here quickly, manager chased her, Joel told her to return my antique piece to me first, Lana promises him that she will return him as soon as possible till then Lana's manager had reached there. She was running away from him, he takes out his gun, Joel was also scared to see this, he tries to run away quickly but the manager starts chasing him, to get rid of him, Joel had to drive very fast, finally, because of his speed, he manages to dodge him, Joel asks why was he saying your chase, Lana said that I had taken some money from him to pay the hospital bill, I used to work for him but don't want to anymore he didn't treat her well. Joel lets her stay at his house for the night but tells her to leave because he has to go to school but Lana refuses, she was not going so he goes to school when he came back, one of his friends was coming out of the house, Joel asks him what did you do with Lana, his friend says that she had another friend with Lana, he was intimate with her, Joel comes inside and says that it won't do here, Lana was also ready to pay him for his house but Joel refuses for this, he threw both of them out of the house. That's time Lana's manager had come here looking for her, Lana and manager get into a fight and she quickly run back home, Joel comes out of the house to talk to the manager but manager threatens him and say you should not get confused by all this, I can be too heavy for you, Joel said I will call the police, nevertheless manager threatened him and left, Lana tells Joel that it is a matter of few days, we'll leave before your parents come back and she will also return his antique piece in return. She comes to him in the night and says why don't we go on the drive, they went to the drive and had high there, 
Lana has given him a business proposal now and says that your friends are very rich. I also have a good network. If we work together both can earn a lot of money. In return, I will be your girlfriend for a few days. Joel doesn't say anything on this. He asks her why are you doing this work. Lana says my stepfather wanted to take advantage of me. For this reason she went out of the house. She does all the work because of this Joel was judging her. Lana does not like it so she leaves from here. Both of them were standing on a hill. His vehicle was also there so suddenly control of the vehicle goes away. There was water ahead. Joel tried hard to save the car but still it goes into the lake. Now he was in big trouble. If he has to save his car then he will need a lot of money because of all these things. He even missed his school. His attendance should be taken so he used to talk to the people of his school as well but no one was agree so in anger he even grabbed the collar of that lady because of this he is suspended for 7 days now he was free and he needed money too so he directly comes to Lana. They start that business. Joel's job was for customer exhibition. He would have brought all his friends to Lana. His business had grown so much that many people had started coming to the house so that Joel could get admission in a good college because of this his father had made a solution. Directly the person who took the interview from the college was sent to his house. When he came home, he sees the whole party. They went to a room for peace but there was so much business going on here so always someone or the other disturbs them. Lano also came and sat in front of him. The interviewer asks Joel, what do you want to do next? Joel said that I want to do business. Joel's percentages were not so good so asks him what to do. John says sometimes in life you have to say that what will happen will be seen. He doesn't care much about this. Even after the interview was over, the interviewer stayed there and was enjoy the party. Lana comes to Joel. Joel says that everything is very out of control. Lana says nothing like that. We made a lot of money and you proved that you can do a good business. Lana wanted to be intimate with Joel on the train tonight so both of them went on the train. After everyone left both of them got intimate. Now that Joel has got the money so he brings his father's car in the next scene. When he returned home all the household items were missing. He thinks that Lana has stolen all this and calls her house but then Lana's manager had reached her house. In actual Lana's manager had stolen all his belongings to take revenge from him. Joel was very helpless because his parents were going to come today. He requests manager and manager comes back with all the stuff but whatever money Joel has, he has to return it all to the manager. Whatever business he did with Lana, he didn't get any profit in it. He took the help of all his friends and puts the whole items as it was. He had to pick up his parents from the airport but he ignores this. By the time they got home, Joel was still packing. Finally he puts everything as it is and his mother notices a scratch on her antique piece. She doesn't like it. She was angry on him about this but Joel doesn't care much about this little thing. He was proud of whatever he did. After a while his father came to him and said that the man had come to you for interview. You didn't tell me anything. Joel thinks that now his father knows everything but Joel's admission was done. His father was also very happy. He say that sometimes you have to take chances in life. Now some time had passed in the movie. Joel meets Lana and asks her that everything was set up. Were you using me? Lana would say that it was nothing like that. They talk a lot while having dinner. Again they spend tonight together. With this the movie ends. Subscribe for more videos like this, turn on notification, and leave a like to help the channel out. Thanks for watching.